Thank you. Back with question four. Sorry it took so long. I was really pretty busy, um, like filming videos, rehousing, and I went to the event show um, one day. And um, so I've just been busy from that. Let's get on with the Q&A series on question four. The question is, how often do you feed your tarantulas? First up is Eriachnids. Let's see what his opinion is. Let's go. Question number four. How often do you feed your tarantula? Um, well, it depends on the, on the species. It depends on how big they are. It depends sometimes on the season. I generally just feed when I think that they need to eat, and I do that based on how they look. So, you know, based on what their abdomen size is, I do kind of keep track of when I fed them last, but I don't use a schedule to actually feed them. It's just a matter of who I think looks like. My son will pass poker female right there is starting to thin out in the abdomen, so she's going to get fed tonight. So that's kind of how I look at it. No real set schedule. Thanks, Arachnus, for your great and amazing answer. But I have a thin tarantula that doesn't eat, and... I've been trying a lot of times to feed it, but it doesn't work. So I'm guessing that abdomen size isn't a sure sign to tell it's hungry. But that's a good way of tracking how many tarantulas you need to feed, especially how, how much you have. Next up is our special guest, which is Tarantula Cat. Let's see what she says. Let's go. So I feed my tarantula based off of its abdomen size. I try to keep its abdomen a little bit bigger than its carapace. Now if it's been a particularly long time since I fed it, like say like a month or so, and its abdomen is still a decent size, I'll usually still offer them food, but I don't really do any sort of scheduling. Hope that helps. Thanks, trying to look out for your great and amazing answer. Um, um, I think it definitely helped all the people who are watching, and it definitely helped me. And the next person who is going to answer is um, Ian Trentula. Let's see what he says. So question number four, how often do you feed your tarantulas? So I have a routine, I feed them once a week, uh, on either on a Sunday or a Monday night. Um, not all of them actually take food. Uh, some have gone three, four months in my care without actually eating. Um, my abbot went, yeah, probably about three and a half months without actually taking any food, but then it, it after it molted, it um, it took some food again. Um, I've known people with like Gramostolas, for instance, like Chili Rose, they have had their, it's not eat for actually two years. That's uh, a long time without any food. I can't go two hours. Um, but yeah, so uh, what we do is I'll, I'll get one out and we'll actually feed one right now for you. Okay guys, so this is my Grammar Stola Polcripes. This is the Chaco Golden Knee. Took that down really well. Thanks Ian Trentil for your awesome answer. Thanks for showing me your feeding Golden Knee. My Golden Knee never ever misses meal. I feed my tarantulas on every Saturday, and if they don't eat it, they don't, don't eat it. If they do eat it, they do eat it. But if they don't eat it, I just try the week after, um, on Saturday. And um, I have one sling that hasn't eaten for a month, and that's okay. But um, let's move on to the next one, which is invertebrarian. Question four, asked by the wonderful little uh, Princess Sophie Pink, is how often do you feed your tarantulas? Now, I have a really erratic feeding regime for mine. I, I Sometimes they're offered food on a weekly basis, sometimes it's, it's a fortnight, uh, sometimes it can, it can be longer than that, depending on when they last fed. Uh, depending on when I buy feeders or if I have feeders, if my breeders, colonies are big enough to use any of that. I personally do not have a strict they must get fed here 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 and here it's food is offered as and when it's available and they either take it or they leave it and to be honest even at times that they've gone prolonged periods say three even four weeks without any food there have been times i've offered them food and they still show absolutely no interest in it uh, abdomen size can be an indicator as to whether they actually need fed or not 
but I have seen tarantulas go, especially uh, Gramasola rosea, for example, go an incredibly long time without eating anything, whether it is offered or not. So uh, how often do you feed? I don't actually know, just as and when. <laughs> Thanks for your great and amazing answer. And my Brazilian black um, hasn't eaten in two months or so. I can't even offer it food because it's took a burrow and blocked it off. Next up is Inverted Ben. Let's see what he said. Let's go. Hey guys, Inverted Ben here. Before we get started, I just want to say a massive thank you to Princess Sophie Pink for having me back on her channel to answer another question in this series. Now today's question is how often do you feed your tarantulas or how often do tarantulas feed? Well, it can be quite a difficult question to answer because it can vary from species to species, size of the creature, or how big the last meal was. So for example, I've got three different sizes here and three different species. I've got a little sea darlingi in this sling pot. It's a little tiny baby, feeds on fruit flies, will eat once a week, maybe twice a week if it was hungry enough. Now, we can move up to a juvenile size spider, which is in here, which is my Acanthoscura geniculata, my Brazilian white knee. This would eat every day if it had the chance, because it's a ferocious eater. However, I do tend to feed this one once a week, maybe once every two weeks, if I've given it a big enough meal. And if we move on to number three, which is in here, this is my adult female OBT. Now you can't see her because she's deep in her burrow. But she will eat once every two weeks, sometimes only even once a month. Now, like I said before, this can vary from species to species. It can vary on the size of tarantulas and it can vary on the amount they've eaten. So it's not really a straightforward question of they have to feed once every two weeks or once a week. I know a lot of people do try to feed between seven to 10 days for all their tarantulas, which is a nice sort of ballpark figure but sometimes they just won't eat. They could bring pre-malt, that could put them off eating. They could have had a big meal last time and that could put them off eating, they could just not be hungry. So there we are guys, three different sized tarantulas, three different times for feeding. However, like I say, a ballpark figure of seven to 10 days is what most people go for and that tends to see people through most of their tarantulas. Thanks and Rosa Ben for your great and amazing answer. Thanks for all, um, thanks for showing us all your um, different size tarantulas and I also have a um, dolingi and it always takes its food on Saturdays and thanks for giving me it, I really appreciate it and next up is Kevin Fellow Ferret, let's see what he says, let's go. And we're back YouTube with your boy Cousin Fellow Ferret, the man spider leg hair appearing on Princess Sophie Pink, his channel. And today this question is quite an inter interesting one because it is, uh, shall we say, complicated. How often do you feed your tarantulas? Me? Anywhere between every three or five days. Some people do once a week, one, some people do twice a week. Um, I know my uh, eight spinach, which I got off the Sidex, good old Sidex, said once a week with a super worm. Okay, that's easy enough. But um, others I feed more regularly than once a week. Um, my slings I may f I try and feed first of all, and then leave my juvies and my few adults that I have later on. So you know, the bigger the tarantula is, the longer it can go without food without causing issues. So, but you don't want to overfeed them. Power feeding is not the best idea because yeah, they grow quicker but they don't grow as big and if you make the backside too big they can have problems molting they have problems molting then they die to be blunt about it so yeah for myself i would say every three days is pretty decent every four days every five days ain't so bad but depending on what it is you may need to feed it every three days so it is effectively once a week but it's in short periods. Uh, well, it's every twice a week, isn't it? Seven days in a week, not... Ignore me. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's roughly what my feeding schedule is. Other people may have different things, but that's what it is. So I would like to thank 
you for tuning in and listening to me have my ramble. Randall Rambo Joker. Anyway, thank you very much. This is Cousin Feral Ferret Sophie Princess Pink's number one fan and high pitched mother. Don't ask me where I was going with that one. I have no idea. So I'm going to wrap this up now. So thank you very much for watching. I'm signing out. Bye bye. Oh, I'm weird. Thanks, because I'm well favorite for your amazing answer. And I've heard of power feeding. I can see why it's not a real, not a good idea. Thanks for your information. Next up is Eight Lucky Dairies. Let's go. Hi guys, Eight Lucky Dairies with my answer for question number four, which is how often do you feed your tarantulas? Now, when I started out, I started out with a plan for all of them to get fed at the same day of the week, every week. But then everybody started molting at different times, which threw everything off. So what I do is all my slings, so from these tinies, all of these guys up here. These guys in here, they all get fed every four days. And then when they get a bit bigger, so to this guy's size and this guy's size, for example, and everything up to Morticia's size, I feed once a week. And then when they molt, I leave a week before I feed them again just to make sure their fangs are hard once they get bigger than Morticia so to Adelaide size trust me she's a big girl and Zelda size which is adult size I feed them every two weeks that way they don't get too fat because if they do get too fat and they take a fall they can pop their abdomens, which is not good. So we do four days. Four days, four days, four days, four days, four days. Four days. Seven days. Seven days, seven days, seven days, seven days. Seven days. And two weeks. Hope that helps and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Thanks, I like Darius for your answer. I started feeding my all of my tarantulas on the same day. It just doesn't, it just doesn't seem to work. And next up is Tropical Full. Let's move on to him. And let's get. Now, for me, I feed them about once a week. The little ones, I sometimes feed them every few days or so. I know there's people that will sort of power feed their their teas just to sort of speed up the growth, but. I think that can have problems at times. Um, it can lead to shorter lifespans and things like that. So yeah, for me, like I said, once a week, maybe a couple of times a week. Yeah. Thanks, Tropical, for for your for, for answering my um, question. And next up is JP's Pet Nation. Let's go. The simple question is: I feed my one time a week between three and five locusts or crickets, depending on what I'm feeding them. Um, it depends on the species of the tarantula as well and the size of the tarantula. It's important that you gut fill your uh, food first, so make sure they're eating a lot of healthy food. Like what I'll do, I'll put fruit and veg into my um, crickets and locusts, so they're obviously full of nutrients for my tarantula or for the rest of my vegetables I have here as well. It's important that you gut load them as well. So, yeah, but the answer to your question is I feed them once a week between two and five locusts, crickets, depending on what I've got on the day. And also guys remember to not overfeed them on fatty food like mealworms and stuff like that. And obviously make sure you vary the diet up as well. And that's more important as well because you don't want them to get bored of the food. And if you was feeding if you was eating the same food over and over again, you would get bored of it too. Alright guys, that's my answer. Wow JP's pet nation, your tarantulas feed like food a lot. 
thanks everybody for joining in this video especially trying to cat thank you i really appreciate your answer and everybody's and your channels will be linked in the description down below and um thanks for watching i hope you like it please like and subscribe and we'll see you all next time good bye